First look at Tesla Model 2 Hatchback 2023. Last year, Tesla launched the Tesla Model S Plaid as the quickest series production car that made a bold statement in the auto industry. That model is priced at nearly $140,000, which is pretty expensive. Over the next few years, Tesla intends to push the limits at the low end of the lineup, not in the aspect of accelerations and performance, but affordability. Now, Tesla is apparently working on a $25,000 car that is going to be made available by 2023. In this video, we take a look at the new affordable Tesla model and see what you can expect. Stay tuned. Let's face it, Tesla cars right now are meant only for the affluent and those who are willing to spend thousands of dollars on luxury and futuristic driving technology. Tesla cars are simply out of reach for most people. However, that's all set to change after Elon Musk announced that Tesla is working on more affordable electric cars. In January 2022, Musk confirmed that Tesla is working on a $25,000 electric car. However, he also mentioned that this new affordable Tesla car won't be releasing anytime soon. Also, at the company's annual shareholder meeting in 2021, Musk didn't confirm the new model will be called the Model 2. You see, many have suggested that the new Tesla model will have called will be called the Model 2 or the Model Q. However, the Tesla chief have rubbished these claims that Tesla doesn't plan to use the former for sure. He said, Model 2 is not a car. There is no Model 2. However, for the sake of convenience, we'll call the $25,000 car the Model 2. The Model 2 was first announced at the 2020 annual shareholder meeting and battery day. Rumor has it that Tesla has completed the prototype of the Model 2 in China. It is believed that Tesla's Chinese R&D center has a major role play in the development of Model 2. Tesla has high hopes for China as a future hub for R&D and manufacturing. During the opening ceremony of the World's Internet Conference 2021 on September 26, 2021, Musk said that the company would continue increasing investments and R&D efforts in the country. After opening the Tesla Gigafactory Shanghai in 2019, it constructed the Tesla Shanghai R&D and Innovation Center and the Tesla Shanghai Superfactory Data Center in 2021. On October 25, 2021, the company announced that it had completed building the globally relevant R&D center and the local data center. Tesla can use the Chinese R&D center for vehicle development, including software, hardware, electronics, materials, etc. The Chinese data center will store China's operating data, like factory production information, for instance. From initial design to final testing, the creations of the $25,000 Tesla is likely to have an influence from its first R&D center outside the United States in an interview with Xinhua Net. Tesla China President Tom Zhu confirmed that the company would be able to design, engineer, develop, and test models at this overseas facilities. Xu said that Tesla had shared the ultimate goal of the Tesla China R&D center on many public occasions. He suggested models made here will indeed be global Teslas, not China exclusive cars. From various images around the web, the Tesla Model 2 shows the $25,000 compact hatchback to challenge and compete with the other electric cars such as the European-made Volkswagen ID3 and the Nissan Leaf. European customers could be the main target for the cheapest Tesla, but China shows the biggest potentials in the current scenario. Now, Tesla is heavily invested in China. The company apparently invited Chinese designers to submit portfolios in January 2020 during the Model 3 launch ceremony. During the event, Musk also stated that the company wanted to create a design and engineering center in China to design an original car for worldwide consumption. Soon after, the company was on a hiring spree in China for the Gigafactory. Speaking of what to expect from the Model 2, Tesla will likely offer the full self-driving pack in the affordable Tesla Model 2, bringing autonomous features to a wider audience. Musk confirmed at the 2020 Battery Day event, where he stated the company was confident in making a fully autonomous $25,000 Tesla model in three years, which has since then changed. Tesla could offer the Model 2 with a new iron-based battery, which promises long cycle life. Further, the shift from nickel to iron for its future entry-level cars indicates Tesla is keen on lowering the cost of the vehicle. An iron base would mean that Tesla would have fewer supply constraints. However, Musk indicated that he had urged mining companies to produce more of the material. With its long cycle life, the Tesla LFP battery would be an integral part of the new entry-level Tesla. Long cycle life is paramount for commercial applications. Since Tesla already introduced the Model 3 with an LFP battery, it could gather essential insights into this chemistry for optimizations in the mass-market Model 2 when it is ready for launch. 
the model is expected to offer a range of around 250 miles enough to make it an affordable and reliable daily driver for urban conditions. The Model 2 will likely come without the luxury features, but it's clear. Tesla won't want to bargain on mileage and other essential features which makes Tesla's most affordable car pretty worth it. So that's it for today's video, hope you enjoyed watching this one. Thank you for